hello, I'm Martin Fenska and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Civilization V as the Zulus. Uh, in the previous episode there was a lot of talking, so today I would like to start playing right away. Off camera I only moved our army from Chichen Itza to Palenque, so we want to take the city as fast as possible. And I actually decided to ignore Roskilde, I'll just keep Palenque. I won't connect it to our uh, territory because I noticed recently that uh, at this point uh, if the city is not connected uh, it's not generating that much unhappiness for quite a while. Uh, if I leave it for too long the, uh, the unhappiness seems to go up but I think we can afford to have this at like 20, 30, 40 turns without um, uh, any connection and it won't be the end of the world. Maybe later we can take Roskilde, but we don't have really the happiness to take a city in this area, so yeah, we'll see what we can do about that. I was even thinking about uh, like connecting uh, the city this way through, uh, through my own territory. If we vassalize them, it should work, so we'll see about that, and that reminds me, I should probably cancel this order and just go for... A village here because the initial plan was to build road down here and we won't need that anymore so let's just um, here build a village and um, we can start bombarding Palenque I really shouldn't take that long with three field guns oh really is this the one without range oops I thought this one was the one without range I didn't check well Let's just move with it. Even gonna need this one. Hmm. We'll see. Fortify. For now, we'll just use these two. Fortify, fortify, fortify. And uh, build a mine. Because I am uh, raising uh, uh, Chichen Itza, I kind of have to have some units there. What are we doing here? Uh, and get rid of some of these roads. Another farm. We can help with the Railroad, uh, back to our war. I'm uh, raising the city, so I uh, need to have some units around here. But why was I talking about that? Oh, uh, I want to talk about something else here. Interesting, when I started moving to Palenque, Denmark instantly bought all these tiles. So it's now quite a pain in the ass. And I'm a bit afraid that Denmark might actually attack with all these fusiliers, the flank of our field guns, which wouldn't really be nice. How much time do we still have? Well, we have 8 turns, so hopefully we'll be able to take Palenque in 8 turns with just 2 field guns. Um, and one more thing, uh, we are now at war with Siam. They declared on us. And uh, do we want to take their capital? Well, we definitely want to take their capital. The question is, can we afford to take it? But since they don't have any vassal, and they are no one's vassal either, uh, we should be able to vassalize them. Uh, the question is, how many cities do we need for that? Probably two. Hmm, let's find out. Okay, you will go this way. They also have Tercios. This won't be easy. How much money do we have? We have enough to buy... where is it? Uh, to buy Landsknecht. Okay. How much damage can we do to these elephants? Quite a lot, actually more than to the Tercio. Sure, let's hit that elephant. Can I kill him? We might be able to kill him. There. Whoops! 
Okay, that's more than I expected. <laughs> a lot more than I expected. Mm, let's move in some reinforcements then. Maybe use these two guys to just force them to move some units this way. And let's attack here. We have some more units around here. Nope. Okay, let's move how many? One. No, oh, Hong Kong. So that I don't forget. I oh, still can't ask for production, never mind. Let's move one Kerasir. 45. And I think I'll keep an eye on this because I actually lose some units there. Uh, we'll start working on the railroad and here we'll just fix another tile. Okay, go. Now, like the main goal. Did you lose something? No. Uh, like the main goal is to get as much culture as possible and get to um, get the ideologies because uh, there is the happiness we need. Once we get an ideology, we should be able to just take all the cities that we need and never uh, be forced to peace out. Okay, Polonga is actually going down faster than I expected. Can wait right next to the city, 45. And here we can just kill another unit because why not? I'll just build another railroad. What are we doing here? Uh, this style needs a railroad. You can build a farm. What about you? I'll just... Now I'll just stay here, build another farm. We have more than enough workers working on railroads. I know about that worker on the edge of the map and I don't want to capture him. But it's not the, that I didn't notice him. Okay, guys, move in. We have to look a little bit more threatening. And how are we doing? Move, come on, move forward. Can, holy moly. This probably is not enough damage. Well, it might be. Actually, it was. Look at all these elephants. Wow. I think we'll be fine. Forward. I think I'll just grab I find an experienced impe ideal of it forester, this guy. How far can we get him? Okay, how are we doing here? And how are we doing on happiness? Somehow we got to 40 happiness, that's plus 10 happiness in one turn. I like that. And here crime, religious divisions. Okay, let's start with Religious divisions that will be solved next turn, and then we have problems with like everything else. Uh, armor should help quite a bit. Public school. Oh, public school. That means we can start spamming archaeologists, right? How are we doing? What happens? Boredom, crime. 
will take too long. Don't have illiteracy. Let's go for like three archaeologists. Um, damn. I made a mistake. Bad production. Oh, but we don't have a chancer. Let's go with that. Let's score it. Just the boredom. Browse, I guess. Don't have monastery. Enjoy. It actually gave us one happiness. Prime religious divisions. And I should help with that. Okay, and now where did I queue up? Archaeologists. I'm pretty sure that I misclicked somewhere. I don't see it. Never mind, I can check the off camera. I think I just queued one in like three cities. So we may as well build them. I wanted to queue up multiple archaeologists here. But oh, whatever. Okay, next I think. What about you? Oh, railroad. Let's get the production for our capital. Go. Start the partisans spawning from the city I'm raising. Oh, there are some units coming. Okay, do we have the damage take Palenka now? I really want to know how much happiness that will cost us. Look at all these civilians. Oh, look at all the great people that we'll kill. Okay, well, definitely want to annex this. And immediately flip the city. And it almost looked like the production and science from flipping a city is now capped at 882. I don't think it's going up anymore. There are definitely some changes to that uh, uh, to that belief. Okay, what did we get? Anything interesting? Mausoleum and Roman Forum. This is just local, I don't really care. And uh, don't really care about this one either. But um, that's quite a few buildings. That's not too bad. Let's get the courthouse up as soon as possible. And now we'll talk. We should be able to vassalize them. Yep. And they can keep their gold. Good. So that's problem on one side, almost solved. Now we just have to make sure Denmark can't do anything here. Do we have enough units to prevent them from going anywhere? And keep. Unit here. We don't need these two guys sitting here anymore. Let's try to get. Actually, Sofia is Danish. Oh, probably a bad idea having a unit sitting inside their territory.
Okay, let's move you this way. You will sit here if I can get into that citadel or I mean fortress. We'll block this style. You'll block this style, and I think they can't get anywhere. And these units. Now can sit on the border here. Okay, this should be fine. I should have enough units to block all the Danish units that might be coming from these cities. I just have to make sure that I can move the field guns away, and I definitely can. So that's fine. Uh, how are we doing here? Customs house, poverty, let's just board them. Hmm. I think... Opera house. I really want to focus on that culture. Poverty boredom. Answer should help with that. Electricity boredom. I don't see anything that would really solve these problems. We could try museum. How much money do we have? Well, let's actually go for it. I'll pay. Or the crime board them. Go with armory. It's gonna be a farm. Oh, we could use the help here. Okay. Let's try to get behind the city. Might be a bad idea. Let's just fortify. I'm hoping that all the medics will uh, heal us up, or at least allow us to survive around the city. And why are you not moving? I forgot about this field gun. Well, that was a mistake. Okay, next. World is not big enough for it to be conquerors. Yep. That's true, you will have to go. Okay, so let's start moving. Actually, do we want to start moving to hysteria? I just realized we could uh, liberate Uxmal now when uh, uh, Mayans are our friends and just ignore Roskill. It's much easier to uh, just block all the uh, all the passes around Roskill there. And now when we have uh, the field guns pretty much in positions to take Uxmal, may as well wait, what, five turns?
will even be able to siege from friendly territory. Let's move you. And get the field guns on the road. And attack the city from these three tiles very easily. One. Some range support. Fortify, fortify. You will just sit in the city until it's gone. Okay, what did we get? Two missionaries that we don't need. And the worker. Yeah, we could use the worker. Uh, heal up. Fortify. Build some mines around Jerusalem. We could use more production. Oh, never mind. I can't build a village here. I didn't notice this one. Um, in that case, let's just build another farm. Anything interesting here? Uh, how is Palenque connected to our capital? Does this count? Is it connected all the way? It actually is. Wow. And I don't think we will lose the connection even after we uh, get rid of Chichen. It's a... Uh... Well, good for us. It's very unlikely that anyone would pillage the road. Oh, I didn't notice that we will have the connection. Good. What are we doing here? I'll have to pillage one tile. Maybe more than one tile. Let's heal this guy as well. And you can hit the city. Okay. I think now they will just run away. Let's actually do some damage to this Tercio. Fortify. Oh, this is useful. Could use another unit on this side of the map. Where's the diplomat? Go. And we actually should flip Kaisel, so let's move the Great Prophet here as well.
Okay, next. That's ambitious. So, show me. What can you do? Uh, yeah, whatever. Why do you need 12 coal? Uh, can we get embassy? Probably not, but we should be able to get some pretty decent trades. That's much better than what I expected. I well, just got 21 gold, or get 21 gold per turn. That should make him friendlier. Promise I don't really want to fight Indonesia. They just lost their capital to Denmark. I could just take Surabaya, vassalize them. And then give them the city back. Okay, let's move some units away from Hong Kong. Do we have any siege weapons around here? We do, but they are ready for the attack on Denmark. Okay, I'll just ignore this war, kill some units, and that's more or less all I want from this. Okay, 45. Uh, you'll go back home. I may have to take this city, so I don't want to pillage too many tiles around it. So I can. Avoid the damage, that would be nice. What am I trying to do with this guy? I'm just removing these roads that we needed for the first war with Denmark. Yeah, I might as well continue doing that. Fix those gems. Get in position. Good. Fortify, fortify. Oh, this is nice. Another uh, AI is not a vassal anymore. It doesn't matter. Denmark controls Lisbon. Okay. 
Okay, let's get those opera houses up as fast as possible. And I definitely have to keep an eye on this because I'm actually risking some of my MP. This guy is pretty exposed. But oh, they are retreating. Oh, hello, Cannon. That should be an easy kill. Venice declared on Denmark. That's also pretty ambitious. This guy in Palenque. We have more than enough experience units now. Fortify. What is that great diplomat? Almost there. Come on, guys, keep moving. I don't know what to build. Alright, military support them. Um, museum that takes just too long. Go for a windmill at this point. We are done with public school. How are we doing on happiness? Not that bad. Actually, let's get Opera House. I was thinking about some uh, um, archaeologists, but Opera House is more important still. Are we done with buildings? I think we are. Fortify. What are you doing here? Nothing. Let's start working on the railroad. Same here. And you can help removing this road. Just too many workers. Let's go this way. Are we done fixing all the tiles around Copenhagen? I think we are finally. Maybe I, I could start rebuilding some of these. Like this should be a village.
think I'll focus on the city as much as possible. Um, yeah, that was a mistake. I didn't realize I can't use their bridges. Same mistake over and over again. Well, in that case, let's just try... To save the situation somehow. I think we will lose the MP. The city can hit them as well. The trebuchet can hit them. Okay, next. Well, somehow he survived. That's a surprise. Indonesia robbed, tre robbed treasury. Enjoy your 28 gold. And that's a well-timed promotion. So can we retreat now? First of all, let's check if we can take the city on this turn. Probably not. It's close. What if I attacked with everything? Uh, let's wait. And move back. Good. Forty five. Uh, do we still need these roads? Uh, why not? I think the repairs are more important. We'll build me another village. Fortify. Okay. the library it only takes like four turns Okay, next. I think this will be... Oh, you want to trade? That's a surprise. Actually, I don't want to trade with him. I don't want to give him the happiness. No, go away. I want to find him anyway. Uh, definitely don't want to peace out here yet. Are we doing happiness-wise? 44. That's much better than what I expected. Now let's take um, Tsukotai, and um, then we end this episode. I really want to know how our happiness will look like after we take another capital. Uh, yeah, flip. 
Kaisel, and the yields are going up. I really thought that it got a cap in this version for each era, but it seems that I was wrong. And where do we move next? I'd real like to get Eiffel Tower. You know what, I think now we are strong enough to just hold our border without the Great Wall. We'll, be have, we'll have to be a bit more careful, but it should be fine, and this should be quite a lot of happiness. Uh, after that... Probably reveal oil, although it might still be corporations, we'll see about that. There anything that we want to do before we capture the city? I don't think so. Um, okay, what did we get? Not much. This is quite disappointing. The city is not even connected. Huh, we only need three tiles to connect it. That's not too bad. Can we vassalize them now? I think we might be able to do it. No. Well, in that case, we'll just take one more city. I think I want to take this one to get access to Venice, right? So yeah, off camera, I will just heal this army, uh, move everything into position. And in the next episode, we'll move south. After we take the city, we should be able to vassalize the rest. And then our target will be Venice. Uh, once you control Venice, you'll be done with the side of the map. And uh, we'll just have the capital cities controlled by Denmark. Good. So we are done with today's episode. As usual, I hope that you liked it. I hope that you're going to join me for the next one again. And until then, have a good time. Bye-bye.